there's three types of ways we can classify a triangle by sides. All right, if, if we have a triangle, if we have a triangle that has all equal sides, we call that an equilateral triangle. That means the measure of each side length, and notice how I represent the, equal of each, the measure of each side length with a tick mark, is what we call an equilateral. If we have two equal sides, so here's three equal sides. I'm sorry, I should probably write that in. Three equal sides. If we have two equal sides, we call that an isosceles triangle. So that means, remember, we can show that they're equal to each other with those little tuck marks. Um, so therefore, if we have two equal sides, we call that an isosceles. And if we have no equal sides, okay, notice how the different tick marks, the different tick marks tell you that each of these measures are going to be different. Even though maybe you say, well, maybe these look like they're equal to each other. You cannot tell me they're equal to each other unless I tell you they're equal to each other or unless the photo says they're equal to each other. All right, so do not assume things are the same measurement or same length just because they look like it. You have to be shown or told that they're equal measure. So if you have three non-equal sides, we call that a scalene. OK? So that's pretty much the notes for today as far as definitions and processes. So what I'm going to do now is...